Noggin, great to be a Tiger. You do April 9th, I'll do it one o'clock. True. Yeah. So Tiger fans, it's Hamp. Hampton. We got the spring game April 9th. One o'clock. And it's free. It's free, y'all. You gotta pull up. It's gonna be a great time. We're great gonna show weather. out. Great weather. Oh. And uh, can't wait to see y'all there. We should come to the spring game to see what we got going on. We got some good things going on this year. We're ready to showcase you. Who are you ready to cook on the defensive side? Uh me personally. Barrett Carter, Barrett Carter. It's all love to fail, but just look, we're gonna throw back to 2017 when my high school be his high school. So I'm just used to winning on this side. That's all I'ma say, that's all I'ma say. I think we're coming to the spring game. Man, to see me, to see me, I'm putting on the show. Nah, man, we, we work hard out here, man. You know, we just wanna give people a show. So that's what, that's what we doing for y'all. It would be helpful. And I'd be so grateful if y'all showed up. Sure. And who, who are you looking forward to kicking, kicking butt on the other side? Man, Rook or Whoa, Whoa, whatever. Yeah, I want him. He didn't do that. He didn't do that. I just know he didn't do that. But if you see this, just when we in the game and we on opposite teams, zoom in on me and just watch. I don't talk too much, you know what I'm saying? Just, just action. None but action. What's up, y'all? Toriano Pry here. Uh, we got another spring practice, but today we're not going to be at uh, the facility. We're going to be at Death Valley. Are you guys coming with us? Wow, bro. What's good, bro? What you got? to have a good scrimmage, too. But to have a great scrimmage. Let's go. I with feel you. you. I feel you. Let's get it. Let's get this work. What up, y'all? On our way to the uh, stadium. About to get on the buses. You ready for scrimmage? Hold on, hold on. Who gave you a camera? KJ, save us up for the ball, bro. Hey, man, we got a ball today. Yeah. Now we gonna make a play. We gonna have some fun. Yeah. First day in the ball. Yeah, they man, you got something to say? I can't wait, wait for some ball. Right now, man. Defense, uh, I feel you. Let's get it. Yeah, what up, y'all? We on the bus now. We're going to the stadium with the guys. Save us out of the ball. What up, what up? Squad. Save us out. Squad. I got a question. How many chickens would it take to kill Ella? <laughs> All right, y'all, we made it to the stadium. I'm gonna go do my thing real quick. Hey, follow me on the gram at Tory Wavy. Yeah, thank y'all for checking in. Ah. Last year I made seven million, then had to do a single show. Should I tell my dude? Everybody locked in. All right, then fly around, let's have fun. Get lined up, cheer for each other. If you guys are not in, make sure I'm watching my position. Knock the ball out. They make the play. Get it out. Want anything else? It's been physical, man. Let's have some fun. Every little thing I do is mad different. Got my little cousin playing Batman. Get my little bro a quick 50 piece. Got the whole trap hit. And I was stacking up all these assets. Give me conducting any bad business. Like, whoa, hey, I keep that drip on me. My, I'm big on me. Huh, hey, I can't ever slip on me. My mama might flip on me. Like, what? What's up, y'all? We're out here. Just finished up a scrimmage. Yes, sir. Getting ready to have the Clemson Life kids out here. We're going to put them through some drills, um, get them right, and starting their football career today. We want this. No, no, no. Y'all over there. Y'all over there. Y'all right here. On the field, let's go. Let's see it. Get it in there. All right, we're vlogging. First day in the valley this spring. Great to be able to have a beautiful day of weather where we could get out here and have a good scrimmage. Um, and then now we're getting a chance post scrimmage here to just have some fun with the Clemson Life students and to watch these players entertain and, and spend time with their fellow fellow classmates is uh, just never gets old. It's been three years since we've been able to come out and kind of have a little county fair and, and watch them compete. Uh, so super excited about uh, having the group out, proud of our guys, 
it's been a really, really fun day. So hope everybody's doing well out there. We're going to see you in the valley soon. We've got a lot of construction going on in the valley, getting ready to build something special. Go Tigers. And y'all should come out to the spring game April 9th at 1 o'clock, and it's free, and you can meet some of these great, great people. <laughs> I don't know if y'all could understand them. Look, what we said was Dead Valley across the street. Show them across the street. You see it? You see it? We're going to be playing a spring game. White versus orange. Come support. We love y'all. We love the Clemson family. Uh, uh, 1 o'clock, April 9th, 1 o'clock. Oh, it is very free. Free 99, you can't beat that. Minus the 99, because it's free. You know what I'm saying? Be there, orange versus white. Get to see your favorite Avenger, Falcon. Caca, caca. My name is Antoine McClain, director of former player engagement and development, and today is our football alumni barbecue. This is one of the greatest pastimes at Clemson. Everybody get to come back with their families and enjoy and bask and talk about all the things that they're doing with their life, and also too, man, all the recap of what they did here as, a, as an actual player here. So right now we got about 150 plus family members, so about right at 200. So yeah, it's, it's a great turnout. Hope everybody enjoy it, man. I'm just happy to see all my guys and we fellowshipping. What's up, Tiger Nation? It's Gage Shavanki here. I was uh, on the team from 2015 to 2019. We're at the Alumni Barbecue, so I want to give a shout out to uh, Anton McClain for setting all this up. It's great to get back and see some familiar faces, meet some guys that have been previous teams that have kind of set the path and foundation for us, guys that have just finished up in the future. So it's great to get connections, kind of see how they're doing in life, and still have a mentor, kind of get to talk to them and just kind of see how they've transitioned out of football, especially for a young guy who is still trying to transition into real world so thank you for everybody and uh, it's good to be back go tigers i love it i love it it's great to see you i love it oh. all right how's everybody watch your old geezers how y'all doing <laughs> no it ain't i'm getting better i'm getting better i appreciate uh big mac putting this thing together man a group of people that are invested in Clemson University and Clemson football in particular. And I'm telling you right now, there has never, ever, 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 bees, been a better time to be a Tiger than right now in 2022. Hey guys, Chris Chancellor here, man. Uh, Chris P.T. Chancellor. This is uh, Chris P.J. Chancellor, Prime Junior, Prime Time. Uh, glad to be back in Clemson, man. Got a lot of my former teammates here. Glad to hear from Coach Sweeney what he had to say today, man. We all one big happy family. And uh, go Tigers. Go man Tigers. Here. Ooh, watch it come. Cuz, we pack it out. Who wouldn't? 50,000 in the stands? Who wouldn't want to see that? The spring game, spring game. The sun is out. The guns are out. And all the fun is out. Let's go. You come did. to the spring game. You know Whole lot of this not going on. <laughs> Even if I lost all of the wealth that I have monetarily, I know I can get it back. Because I know who I am, I know what I know, and I know who I know. Knowledge is not power. Applied knowledge is power. <clears throat> Wherever it is you want to be, it will not come from you talking. It will come from you doing. Hey, what's going on, Clemson family? This is Steven Stack and I had the honor to speak with uh, the Clemson football team over the past week uh, in a financial literacy series. 
And my goal was I wanted to talk to the fellas about the things that I did know when I was around their age, 18 to around 22, 23. But just as importantly, if not more importantly, all the things that I didn't know that I wish I knew at that time. And so we covered all kinds of things from money management and budgeting to goal setting, investing. It was really good, really comprehensive, but everything was wrapped around this idea of wealth isn't just about what's in your bank account. It's also about the person that you're becoming. My name is Malcolm Green, rising junior defensive back at Clemson University. I was expecting to learn a lot about the credit, about credit and just about how, how to build my credit and understanding different like financial terms that are kind of foreign to people our age that play sports. Learned a lot about my building my credit and investing. Did a great job making it more simplistic and relating it to like shoes and just made them more simple and helped the whole team understand them. Look at the average season length. Okay, so you got the kickers at the top of the food chain. That's because they don't get touched. Right, body can stay healthy. You a kicker? Yeah. Okay, so, <laughs> congratulations, right? You got, as long as you can kick it between the uprights or, or punt it far, then, you know, you got a good opportunity. What I'm trying to show and prove you to this is not to say it can't be done, but the reality is that you're going to spend more time post NFL. Even if you're a Tom Brady and you play till 45, he, Tom Brady will still live most of his life not playing football. Okay, so you need to do what you got to do. And again, that's part of what these first couple classes were is making sure you're taking advantage of this opportunity and putting the foundation in place. What's up, Tiger fans? Man, this is Nick Schusler back home, quarterback here, uh, finished in 2017. Really excited to give back and have an opportunity to, to pour into some of these kids. And uh, most of what we've talked about, um, the two sessions that I was responsible for is touching on the beginning of the NIL and how that's changed the whole landscape of college football and how these kids can take advantage of it and what they need to be doing from a tax perspective. And then we touched on, hey, you know, after college and everything that Clemson offers in the platform is becoming a young professional. Right? Either you become a young professional in the working world and become a young uh, professional athlete. Right? And so two different career paths, but both uh, getting the foundation laid down. You know, what benefits does each offer? How should I be saving money? Being responsible for taxes? Who you should have on your team? Hey, how y'all doing? Uh, Josiah Carlton here, senior linebacker. With these Paul Journey meetings, you know, you're really taking in a lot of stuff in a little bit of time. You know, they have like great speakers coming in that just touch on a lot of bases that, you know, you need to learn in life, but everybody doesn't get access to them. For me, you know, coming from a different school, it's, it's really big, you know, because I'm learning a lot of stuff that I'm going to need to go into the next step of life, you know, growing into a man. And, um, you know, I'm just grateful for the opportunity. I want to give a huge shout out to JD. Carly, Rashar Hall, all of them with Paul Journey for just giving us the opportunity to like be included in a financial literacy class. Cause that's something that a lot of people pay for at the age of like 30, 40 years old. And they just bless us with the opportunity as teenagers, 20 year olds, 21 year olds, to get that same knowledge and learn a lot today. Paul Journey is just an unbelievable resource. Um, when I finished my time here, the program was being built out and still being done, but what it is today and what it's evolved to is absolutely amazing. You think about um, leaving college, learning all this information, uh, whether it's from business or whatever your major was, and uh, you leave and you don't know the fundamentals of, of winning with money. Uh, financial Literacy 101, I mean, what is a 401k? How should I be saving money? What is budgeting? I mean, how do I take care of my own taxes? What Paul Journey's done and is currently doing with these kids, and starting them from a freshman, and giving them the ability to learn, to get skills and real life applicability, to then take, to apply to uh, life beyond here is, 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 is amazing. What, what the whole team is doing is setting these kids up for, for a long, prosperous career and, and being able to really put their best foot forward and take care of not only themselves, but, but their families. All right, guys, y'all need to come to the spring game this year. We're trying to get 25,000. 25? 25, 30,000. 30? Your thing's 30? Nah, we want 35,000. 35,000? What do you mean? We're shooting for 40. Let's sell it out, baby. <laughs> <laughs>